Happiness means an enlightened realization of human dignity and a craving for human liberty which prizes itself above mere selfish satisfaction of personal comforts and material wants and would readily and joyfully sacrifice these. That's Gandhi, Young India, March 5th, 1931. In this uh, brief quote, uh, Gandhi has made really a number of very significant points about human happiness, its relationship to human dignity. And notice he doesn't say to one's dignity, but to human dignity. We are all interconnected when we downgrade or disrespect the, the dignity of another person. We are automatically disrespecting our own. Next point that I want to bring out is it talks about the craving for human liberty, which prizes itself above mere selfish satisfaction of material wants and so forth. Again, for him, there was almost no such thing as a separate happiness, an individual happiness. The binding up of one's feeling of fellow feeling and empathy with others was happiness, even if they are not happy. If they're not happy, you try to do something to make them happy. If they're happy, you share in it. I guess there was an old expression, happiness shared is doubled, grief shared is halved. And he's illustrating that very nicely. And the final point that, of course, has to leap out of you, if you know anything for, about Gandhi, is sacrifice. That uh, Here is where he really takes off in an utterly different direction from our prevailing civilization. <laughs> he once wondered whether that was actually even an appropriate term. That we think happiness will come from getting stuff. And for someone with a Vedantic background like Gandhi's, happiness, real happiness, deep, lasting happiness would come from renouncing stuff. So all of that was packed into this very brief comment. 